Now, the Kenyan police have fired tear gas on Monday to disperse a crowd of more than 100 demonstrators who were demanding that the government reopen three private TV channels that it had shut down last week over the coverage of the opposition protests. Now, the three stations had been shut down after trying to live stream an event that was held by the opposition leader, Rala Odinga, where he symbolically inaugurated himself as president in a direct challenge to Kenyan President Uhuru Kenyatta. The two of the three television channels that were shut down resumed partial broadcasting on Monday, but the third channel has remained off air so far. The Raila Odinga himself appeared outside the court as the country's high court has ordered the police to produce the opposition politician Miguna Miguna. The Miguna, a lawyer, was detained and then released on bail after he stood beside Odinga at the, a Tuesday's rally and declared himself the general of Odinga's national resistance movement. It is very sad that our country has descended to this level. We have a government that refuses to uh, recognize the rule of law, to respect the court's orders, basically inviting the citizens not to respect the law.